everyone, welcome back to Hoosier Squad. Welcome back to another video. And then, okay, let me fix that lighting. And in today's video, I'm um, gonna do just some general maintenance on an engine. Yeah. Trying to get this flywheel off. This one. And then uh, maybe a carburetor swap if there's enough time. Because I only can upload like 15 minutes at a time for videos. So might be a part two. I know people love those. So. Yeah, I'm just trying to get this part of the flywheel off so I can put this. So I can put a different size one on. This one has always had trouble. Like when you pull the pull start, this one doesn't like to move. Well, let me just do that. Well, it's wanting to prove me wrong today. But normally, when it's on the engine, it doesn't like to turn over. Like it doesn't like to have the pull start work. It likes to turn the engine over. And we all know that's not good. I, I don't know, maybe I fixed it though. Um, but yeah, I've been trying to get this off. And hopefully I can do that. I'm gonna put this, kinda want to just have it so you guys can see what I'm doing there we go so now we put this down here. Should be able to. Yep. That'll do it. A little more. All right. So, um, start a time lapse. See if I can get this thing off, and then go from there. It decided not to come off, so I don't think we're gonna be able to that swapped out in this video. I just it won't, it just it won't come off. Yeah, I was turning this throughout the time lapse. I tried using the monkey wrench, it just wouldn't work. So, yes, we're gonna swap a carburetor then. Um, I have to drain the fuel first, but as you guys do know, if you remember the first video, got this bike. Now it's having issues with the fuel. I think it's fuel starvation. So I'm gonna have to swap that out. Um, I got two carburetors in mine, and I can show them both real quick. They're both connected to gas tanks right now. I have to fix that. First one is from a similar. It's from a similar style engine. I mean, all my engines are basically the same, but this is like an older one has the older size in it. Now that motor over there might only be a three horse, but it is capable of running both size carburetors. But that one's yellow, so I don't, it won't really go with the paint job as well. So I also have this one. And this one's kind of attached to this engine. Well, this gas tank, not the engine, sorry. So if this goes, the gas tank has to go with it. But it is going to be a lot easier to make a decent throttle system out of it than the other one. Choke. Choke will have to fix. That won't be that hard. Um, 
So I feel like this one is the best option. Where's the cap? Um, well, I have to find the gas cap. I believe it's around here somewhere. I remember seeing it not too long ago. So yeah, this one as well is another option, which I feel like is the better option. It's because it's a kind of a newer one. Well, as new as a Briggs will get. <laughs> so yeah, uh, the choke is right here. It has a decent, it has a decent choke on it. wide open choke that's closed off and it still lets a little bit of extra air in than your normal one would so yeah all I gotta do is bolt this back down to the frame of it and this one's ready to go pretty much I gotta put the air filter back on too but that's not gonna be that hard because it's only, it's only an air filter that's over there um, with the different parts different stuff um, it did have a switch system, which is right here. It doesn't work that well anymore. This is this is off a engine my friend gave to me. Uh, CJ Games, thank you, buddy. Uh, go check him out. Yeah, he he does a lot of gaming and vlogging videos. I do more of this stuff and Offered Outlaws, which is. It has like has more videos right now than my car stuff, my like my engine stuff. But we'll change that with this video. So yeah, um, I'm gonna get start a time lapse of putting all the stuff back on, and then we'll see where we're at with that. I cannot find the top of the air filter, but just getting the bottom of it on for now will do fine. And I'm sure that I'll find it as soon as I stop recording. So, yeah, I'm just gonna start mounting the stuff up. There's it. Yep. So I'll go ahead and start uh, another time lapse yet again. Um, just gonna try this. All right. All right. So we got it all done. All bolted down the three bolts that it needs because it doesn't have this on there anymore so it doesn't need that extra one over here which will increase airflow which will help with power gains don't ever do that oh battery's low don't ever do that um well i can't find like i said i can't find that uh air filter top where I put that on too. Um, well, I guess we'll just bolt it onto the bike now. Okay, I need to add another. Hold on. Excuse this choppy movement. Oh, I see that lighting too. I mean, you look like a ghost. Okay. Oh, sorry. Tapping my thumb. That's better. You still see that though? No, you can't. Just can't seem to figure it out. <laughs> so, um, just gotta find that air filter top. I'll do some more looking for it off camera. I'll put it on. I'll put it on on camera. 
but I just gotta look for it and find it first. So yeah, I'll see you all then. Hello again, everyone. Uh, back for another time lapse, I think. So, um, did find the air filter. Slides in there like this. Um, I still haven't found the cap. Well, actually, I didn't find the air filter. I got another one. But I still haven't found the cap. So, I either gotta find the cap or find something that'll fit on top of the air filter the, that allows airflow and will hold this down. So, I think the second option would be better, almost. Yes. And then, um, I got some. Where did they go? Okay, I think they're over there. But, oh wait, it's right here. I got some new. Got some throttle joints I found. Found these throttle joints. They're in the shop. So we'll be putting that on too, that'll be fun. Um, yes, I'm waving them like this. But, um, so they'll just kinda, I wanna take off the air filter again to do this. So we'll be doing another time lapse yet again today. It has this little switch. Which has stop, slow, fast, and choke. I just realized that might be backwards. It might be backwards for me. So yeah, we'll be installing these onto the bike. Um, I had like a little bolt that went on there to hold this back from, from sliding forward. Um, we're gonna cut a bit off actually because if we don't, we'll have a lot of access cord. We don't want that. So, um, well, like I said, time for another time lapse.